Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Let's Play Europa Universalis 4 with me, your host, Mordaz the Red. Uh, in this episode, probably a little bit more peace, though we're probably going to have to deal with a rebellion. Uh, we did really nothing last last episode, uh, mostly because we had to stay at peace. Um, uh, we have... We have no air right now. Uh, Hakim's uh, uh, needs to. Hakim Hector von Hollerson, Hollerson uh, needs to uh, get his willy working. Uh, but in the meantime, we're just gonna have to stay stay at peace until we can attack Danzig. Uh, out, oh, they're allied with Bohemia, so. We'll eventually have to attack them. Let's see. I have a feeling that it's all the same. Oh, 1492. Even later. Great. Cool. We need him. We need to, like, prevent the succession war. <laughs> That'd be great. In the meantime, we do need to recruit some people. Pause. We already have two cav. I don't need other other cav. Wait, no. Wait, that's Merc. Don't want Merc. Want normal. There we go. Oh bloody heck! We need to get our troops back up to normal. Yay! Oh, he's so much better. Not the greatest, but he's better. Uh... No! <laughs> ah, sure, jo jo Johan. Cicero, that's good. Yeah, yeah, we lost some Kaze bellies. That's fine. As long, as long as uh, we have an heir, that's all that really matters. Yep, we do need to bring up our army maintenance. Yay, Imperial Reform. That's great. Curious. 6.5. So let's... Why don't we... Take them all into here. Question. Is this the highest development? 10? Yeah. They don't spawn anywhere, they don't spawn setting, which is fine. And just to make sure, let's. Ah, uh, oh, good. We have military access with them. Do we have military access with you? Obviously, you're my vassal. Alright, 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 all right. So. Whoa, England. Plus to Scotland. Dang. Alright. Who should we make friends? Whoa, Burgundy's gotten a little larger than they should normally do. Alright. Who are electors? Whoa, everybody's. If we, uh, to be honest, right now, if we, if it was, uh, if it was today, we'd get elected. So 
So let's improve with. Uh, no, let's improve with uh, Trier. I don't think we have any improved really. Oh, we do. How about the Palatinate? Let's let's improve with you. I'm just curious, Brunswick. When do we... who are your allies? South Swinburg. Yep. It's gonna be a while before we can tech up. So let on pause. <sighs> loans, loans, loans. This is going to code con Oh, we got no war exhaustion anymore. Great. Separatism is going to take down for a while. Our legitimacy is constantly going up, which is good. Yeah, we lost. Well, we lost our claim our vassal, so and eventually we can integrate them. Ah, oh, what's this? Uh, very, various innovative ideas of the Renaissance spring through Italy. Already a number of wealthy families have decided to find, provide financial support, promising artists. Are we, are we to let history pass by without leaving our mark on it? Gain 10 prestige or lose 5 prestige? Let's gain 10 prestige. 12 ducats. 12 or so ducats. So. Yeah, we're losing some claims. Mostly because we have to be at peace, and we still have to be at peace with Bohemia. And we have no aggressive expansion anywhere, or at least, yeah. Our aggressive expansion. Oh wait. Uh yeah. Uh sale of indulgences, Joachim the second Hector was compelled by his father, Joachim the first Nestor Nestor to sign an inheritance contract, which pr he promised to remain Roman Catholic. Joachim Nestor has co financed his younger brothers, the Archbishop Yeah. Uh, elevation to the Episcopal see Episcopal seat of the of Hallebrands, the accumulation of the seas of Magdeburg and Mans by incurring huge debts with the banking house of Fugger in order to pay the Holy See to pay off the debts so King Nestor agreed to recover these costs from the population of his electorate by permitting the sale of indulgences. Uh, plus plus five percent national tax modifier plus uh, papal influence. That's fine. That's fine. I'll let that When's the next loan due? 80... No, no, sorry. 85. So, that's good. Teutonic Separatists are back. But... They're unlikely to fire.
Great. We got day assault. So, hey. Yep. Yep, renew the loan. Till the Pomeranian Separatists either don't exist anymore, or... Or not. Ugh. Yeah, that's fine. Austria ca calls us to arms. Okay. Who are you going? You're going against Brabant Flanders. So just just so I know. No one I can get a claim on. Okay. I'm still not going to move for a while. Okay. Modifiers expired. Ah, fuck. There goes our navy again. Which reminds me. Let's uh, just cancel that. Always forget about our navy. <sighs> Still waiting here for a bit. Oh, and for those wondering what happened to the two episodes a day I was talking about earlier, uh, last week, actually, uh, to be honest, I did, uh, more of the math itself just is not possible, uh, between the time I have to work my, this job, my other job, I'm sorry, my two normal jobs, and do this, it's just not feasible. As much as I'd love to do it and actually speed up the episodes and everything, it's just not likely to happen. Crap. Ah. That's been... Yeah, I know. Is there anything that we can do to get stability? I remember there's one that gives us stability. Isn't there? Wasn't there? Ah. Mandified local state. Oh. Well, let's uh, Diplotech up. It's gonna be forever before we can get military tech. Yeah. And especially considering they have cannons, it's just not gonna be pleasant for us. So I'm actually just gonna stay over here. Uh, I'm gonna recall our Mecklenburg. Dude. Alright. Uh, let's go improve with. Uh, let's go improve with. Trier again. Let's insult them. Oh, gotta wait. Yeah, 
That's a little bit of stuff. I'm really not going to help a whole bunch in this war. <laughs> yeah. Now, is this a defensive war? We're going to need. Yeah, this is a defensive war. Just out of curiosity, how long until we have enough military tech? Monarch points. Tech up. 1490, so four years or so. Before we can tech up. It's gonna take us even longer. For Diplo, that's gonna take us 22 Gemini Christmas. We could vassalize Danzig. You know what? That would be fine. But we can't even go to war with him until uh, until 1492. So not really worth doing it. So yeah, we can't really do any of these right now. So thanks for the missions there. this oh we can finally get get idea as much as I'd love to have more infantry combat ability we need the tech more than we need that so we get to wait some more because freaking ah as soon as we can we're gonna stop focusing on anything because I'll give us an additional point of diplo power and additional point of military power So, next loan is about to come due in September. Loan after that we can pay is in fourteen eighty-eight. Okay, let's to talk separatists. Ah. I don't want to move them off a of setting. Because they're right now keeping it down a bit, so. Alright, let's take a look. What who are we at war with? Can we get to Holland? Yeah. Ugh, no, I don't want to get off the get off of it. Because literally, as soon as we do, it's gonna fire. So, yeah. Let's repay your loan. Oh! Perfect timing. Oh, thank you. And we win this really quickly. Boom. Dead. Done. We only lost about 3,000 men. So, that's great. Well, let's actually go to Berlin and recover a little bit. Not worried about the Teutonic Separatists. Oh, and we're losing buckets of ducats again. Brittany's got 20,000. Oh, wait. That's that's Brittany and Holland. They have 14,000 men. Ah! Why are you coming up here? Pfft. 
I just realized I'm still on speed four. <laughs> like, I'm at war at speed four. That's not a good idea. Curious, who are we at war with again? I'll steal a little bit from Brumbrant. Ugh, salt crisis, reducing production efficiency. That's not good. Marching down to Brabant. Take some of Brabant's gold, to be honest. Oh, don't tell me they're com coming here. God damn it, man. I just want to loot some gold. I don't really actually want to get hurt in this shit. There goes all our truces. Yep. Okay. Well, I'm going to take a break here. here uh, mostly because we can't really do all that much in this war except lose. Because... Uh, Austria's losing. I mean, seriously, they're getting their butts kicked. I mean, they have low war enthusiasm. I don't really want to be in this war. I just don't want them to take any of my stuff. But that'll be in the next episode. As always, uh, comment and critique in the comments below. Uh, like, subscribe, and share if you want to see more of this, and as always, thank you very much for watching.